Hi everyone, Phil from Tech for Tech here. Today we're going to be looking at this from Patriot. It's the Patriot Burst. It's a two and a half inch solid state drive, which has obviously got a SATA connection on it. It's got a maximum read speed of 560 megabytes per second and a maximum write speed of 540 megabytes per second. We do have links in the description below. Best to click them for the price because the prices on these change daily. So again, for the cheapest price in your country, click the links below. Before we go on to the main video, if you would do us a favour, click that like button, subscribe, click the bell as well. And that way you'll get notifications of new videos and live streams we do. Again, doing all these things helps support the channel. And helping to support the channel allows us to release more videos, better quality videos, and more content exclusively just for you. Okay, as you can see here, you've got the Patriot Burst 2.5 inch SSD Serial 88 free, pretty much standard 2.5 inch solid state drive, 3mm thick, which is pretty much standard. SATA free is a 2.5 inch form factor. Performance, it gives it 8 out of 10, but that's their own performance index, and 8 out of 10 what? Uh, against other SSDs of like it, or is it against SSDs as general? They're saying it performs just as well as a Samsung Evo. It doesn't really say anything other than high performance, but high performance against what? Uh, again, we just don't know what they're comparing it against. Now, on these drives, according to the back, it runs up to 560 megabytes per second on the read and 540 on the write. But it doesn't say that actually, no, that isn't true. That's only if you get the larger versions, like the one terabyte version. This is a 240 gigabyte version, which if you actually dig enough on their website, you'll find the maximum read. Okay, it's only a little bit different, but it is actually 555 megabytes read, so only five megabytes in it, but the write is 500 instead of 540. So it's one of those things I don't like about solid state drives, the way they say, yeah, the speeds are up to check, blah, 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 blah. It's a bit like putting a sign on a car uh, and saying, this car can do 0 to, 30, uh, 0 to 60 in three seconds. And then putting a little star after it, and then you have to dig around on the internet for half an hour to find out actually. Now, this one doesn't actually do that, it only does it in uh, what 10 seconds. You just got to spend 20 grand extra to buy the version. What doesn't actually go up to that speed? It should say the exact speed on the front or the back of the box, not saying, Oh, go and have a look on the website. Okay, so this is what you've got inside the box. There's no instructions, anything like that, which you shouldn't do really these days. It's a black plastic box. You've got the specifications on the top, which, okay, looks okay. Not best if you want to display it, in all honesty. And on the bottom, there's nothing. Where they're supposed to be the specifications on the bottom, it's on the top. It's as if they put the sticker on the wrong side, in all honesty. Uh, but there you go, gives you a rough idea. That's all there is to it. It's a standard two and a half inch drive in a plastic case rather than a metal one but other than that we'll have a look at the speed tests and see if it's as fast as it says it is okay in the first test we did we used crystal disk mark and we did a read test to see how fast it reads information and as you can see here the patriot burst managed to get 558 megabytes per second which is pretty good going and is one of the top performers on the list so that's pretty good and it definitely outperformed for example the maxitor now on this next test we use crystal disk mark as well but we do the write test and here it got 505 megabytes per second not far off the top one on the list so it actually performed pretty well considering it's a value drive so that's pretty good on the next test now we're going to go on to using atto for our test program and again this is a read test so you can see here the Patriot Burst got 535 megabytes per second. It again was one of the leading drives what we've tested, which is pretty good. It's constantly getting high results. Don't get me wrong, it's a little bit behind what they say on the box, but you can find that when using different programs, you can get slightly different results. Now onto this next test, we use Atto again, and this is a write test. And as you can see here, we've got 517 megabytes per second. It was actually joint fast so it did very well again this is a budget drive so it's doing pretty well considering thank you for watching this video everyone it's really appreciated you made it all the way to the end 
please make sure you subscribe, like, comment, and even click that bell so you get notifications of new videos and live streams. It does help support the channel, and supporting the channel basically means that we can release more content for you, and also better quality content going forward. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.